Man. Hey y'all, happy Sunday. I'm not I'm not gonna do a cooking video tonight. Uh it's not really a rant video, but it's uh, some shit I need to say. It's been on my mind for a while. And so I'm going to say it tonight. Uh, we get a lot of comments on our videos. Uh, we got likes, shares. Uh, I met some great people on here, man. And... Uh, most of our comments are good, and, and I appreciate that. I, I appreciate all the views, uh, but I get some comments uh, about Terry that I, I really don't appreciate. I mean, I like I, I'm like I don't, you know, I, I don't give a fuck what you think, man. I, I I'm gonna do whatever I want to do. I've always been like that, but uh, just to set the record straight. Uh, if you don't know me and Terry personally, if you haven't interacted with us, you don't know our relationship. Uh, we can go back to fucking day one, back in 1982. No, even before that. Me and Terry met before 82, but uh, when, when Terry met me, she was just a corn-fed heifer. And, and she'd never been nowhere and done anything. She met me, and I had been everywhere and done everything. By the time Terry met me, I, I had snorted every powder there was to snort, ate every pill there was to eat. I was like a fucking stone-cold fucking drug addict, almost. And, uh... I, I don't know what she saw in me. She's five years younger than me. And, uh, and I, I don't know what she saw, but there was something. And so uh, we got together. And we've been together since 1982. Uh, she's let me live my life as I wanted for the most part since then. She set down a few rules. And uh, Lord knows I needed rules in them days. Uh, man, I, I, I drank gin like a motherfucker, and I, and I snorted coke and fucking, I did everything. I, I was like fucking, you know, I was out there, man. And I know I needed something, and uh, for whatever reason, Terry came around, and uh, she she's let me continue doing what I wanted to do my entire life. I mean, she she's... Uh, with a few exceptions, you know, I mean, she let me go. Um, she said uh, from day one, fucking Jen was out of the picture, man. So she put Jen off the limits, and so I don't even mention the word Jen anymore. Um, uh, I think you've put, named it a few times in this video. Yeah, but I don't, I don't, I'm not fucking drinking it. And there's none in the house, and uh, it's been a long time since I had any gin. <laughs> and I don't miss it. Uh, I really don't miss it. Uh, uh, she let me smoke my herb for as long as I wanted to smoke my herb. And uh, she said the powder was out of limits. I had to cut the powder out. And so there went the crank and the fucking coke. And uh, I, I've managed to survive without that. And actually, I've been drug free now for three fucking years. I, I've been drug free uh, for three years. I I uh, I can't wait till I retire. I don't have to take a piss test and I can smoke a fucking joint again. But mm -hmm. uh, and she's still saying I don't need that shit. But. Uh, uh, we've been through a lot, man. Terry's put a lot, well, put up with a lot of shit from me, you know. And uh, well, what you see on my videos, and that's actually me. I don't give a fuck, man. I do shit my way. I don't care. Uh, I'm an armory discharged veteran. 
I, you know, I, I served five and a half years in the Air Force. You know, I'm going to say what I want to say. What's up, dog? I'm going to do what I want to do. I work every fucking day of the week, man. I, I, I fuck, I work every day. I get up at 3.30 every morning. I may drink 27 beers today, but I don't need an alarm clock to wake me up at 3.30 so I can go to work. You know, it's just something I do. Uh... Those of you that actually know us and have interacted with us, you know, that's, you know what our relationship is, mine and Terry's. Um, those of you that just watched the videos from fucking Madagascar or fucking Columbia or Anchorage, Alaska, and you listen to Terry bitching at me or uh, making her snarky fucking remarks. That's all you get. You, you don't know what we're dealing with. You know? We have our own thing here, man. And it works for us. Uh, we've been together since uh, June, May, May. Fuck it. Well, June of 82, basically. June of 82. Me and Terry have been together. That'd be 1982 for you young children. You do the math. 1982 to now. In that time, we have had maybe, and I'm going to stretch maybe with a long fucking ruler here, yardstick, three arguments. That's something me and Terry don't do. We don't argue. We don't fuss. We don't fight. We don't throw shit. Man, I, I was I was raised on that shit, man. I mean, I, that's something we just don't do. We don't fucking argue. I've known people that within five years, they've been married three times to different people. But that's not me and Terry, you know? So we, we live our life, and we do our shit our own way. People used to ask me, uh, years ago I had people ask me, I, how, how, what do you guys do? How, how do you not argue? And I would tell them, I'm like, back in those days, because we had different jobs. We worked same shifts, basically. We was working day shifts. And I would tell them, I said, like, well, we have an open marriage. I do what the fuck I want to do. She does what the fuck she wants to do. And mostly we just sit at home at night and watch TV together. And that's, you know, that's what we do. I mean, Terry can do whatever the hell she wants to do. I don't give a fuck. I, I told her from day one, whatever makes you happy, do it. Because if you're not happy, you can't make me happy. I'm going to do what I want to do that makes me happy. Because if I'm not happy, I can't make you happy. And so, basically, we have done... Pretty much nothing together for 40 fucking years, and we've stayed happy. Well, it's not quite 40, but it will be soon. <laughs> Don't give me that look. <laughs> I'll give you that look if I want to. But, yeah, so you, you guys want to offer uh, comments about Terry? You come fucking meet us first. And uh, see our relationship together in person. And... Uh, like, I, I'll grant you, it's not everybody's. I mean, because I, I, I'm a hard person to live with. Um, I'm hard-headed. I don't like change. And I'm old-fashioned as hell. And you're an asshole. I'm an asshole. <laughs> I don't understand computers and cameras and telephones. I can't send a text on my computer or upload a picture on my telephone. I don't understand all that shit. Terry does all that stuff for me, man. All I do is fucking drink beer and cook. That's all I do. And I, I just, uh, like I say, I mean, like, most of the comments we get are good. I mean, Terry gets some good comments and shit. But some of them are, like, fucking downright nasty. 
really fucking rude, and, and she doesn't deserve that. Lord knows, after spending all these many years with me, she just doesn't deserve that. And I, I just... I, 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 this video's been on my mind for a while, and I just wanted to do it. And so now I've done it. And, and I'm just going to say, you know, fuck you, we do what we want. To paraphrase a Jefferson Starship song. That'd be Stairway to Cleveland, in case you didn't know. But anyways, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just an old hippie, just fucking living my life, man. And I, 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 I'm drug free, and... Uh, no, you're not. I am too. You have that in your hand. That's beer. That ain't a drug. Bullshit. Monks make beer. Monks live on beer year-round. Beer ain't a drug. Oh, bullshit. Love is a drug. I should go get me a hooker. <laughs> well, I ain't got the money. And I don't know any that would accept me. But So, anyways, that, that, that's all I wanted to say. Uh, say thumbs up to Terry. Fuck you and your snarky remarks about her. I, you know, we, we don't give a fuck. You keep making them. We, we don't care. We, uh, you know. And some of them, some of them I actually deleted as soon as I've seen them. Without even telling her about them. I mean, because some was downright fucking nasty. And I'm like, you know, that's just totally uncalled for. I, I, you know, I, I don't mind you calling her a bitch every now and then. But some of that shit's just unheard of, man. And there's no reason for it. And, um, uh, 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 and, and, and that point, too, I would like to say a special thank you to all the people that stood up for Terry. Because in some of these remarks that she's gotten, remarks made about Terry, I've had a lot of people stand up for her. And uh, I'd, I'd like to say thank you. I, I know there's several. Uh, Ange, Russ, uh, who, who the fuck else? Um, I think Baloney Boy said something. There's been a few of them, though, that, that have stood up. And uh, so anyway, if you want to know more about us, come visit us, man. Stay, spend the weekend with us. You, you'll see, you know, how we are and who we are. And, uh, mostly what you see is what you get. And, uh, you know, she treats me the same way every day as she does on film. I live with that. It's kept me alive for all these years. And God knows I wouldn't be alive today if it had not been for Terry. And, uh, Lord. I like a smoke a joint, but mm -mm. I'm not touching no gin and I ain't touching no coke. So, I, I give those days up long ago. So y'all think what you want, say what you want, and come meet us and try to understand who we are. Those of you that know, we appreciate it. And uh, with that, I'm going to say, fuck you. We do what we want. Have a good one.